You are tuned into Wisdom Pills with Dr. Vincent Opong, inspiring you to become all of you. Now stay tuned for another inspiring episode that will move you to become all you were born to be. Hello, hello, hello. Greatness, how are you doing? I believe you are doing fabulous. I am also doing fantastic right here in the Wisdom Palace. Today I'm coming to you with Wisdom Pills, pill number nine. Pill number nine says that complacency breeds laziness. It is easy to get complacent, especially when you make it to your destination. In chapter two of Wisdom Pills, we are talking about hard work. That after you have discovered your purpose, you've got to work hard at it. And at this point, we are talking about maybe after working hard a little bit and getting to a place where maybe you desire to be or you are almost where you expect or where you want to be. And when you get to this particular stage or point in life, it is easy to get complacent. We all know some leaders who made it to the top and before um, they knew it, they started crumbling down. A typical example I can give you is Iron Coke. Um, Coca. Ian Coca was, um, he was working with Henry Ford II for Ford cars. And um, he expected to replace Henry Ford II, which didn't go that way. When many people were being fired, he um, thought it was, he was going to be kept. But apparently he ended up getting fired as well. But that's not the point. He, from there, it actually elevated him to become the um, CEO of um, Chrysler. And what Iron became is, 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 is just, <laughs> is a very explicit explanation of what this particular pill is about. Or this particular pill number nine, complacency. This man became complacent. He thought he had arrived. He was lavishing all the riches and the wealth on himself and forgetting that which took him to the top. We can talk about many people who have made it to that place and yet they forgot that it was something that brought them there. And the only thing that can keep you to the, at the top is the same thing that brought you to the top. The great and the late Mandela said that it is unfortunate that man had to always go through the valley of the shadow of death over and over again before he achieves his desires. And I believe that from there is where this pill makes more sense. That after you have gone through the valley of the shadow of death many times and you have achieved your desire, don't get complacent. Because if you get complacent, you might end up being lazy. I wrote something in here and it's very encouraging. So I want to read it verbatim to you. And I know it will be a blessing. In the book, The Wisdom Pills, pill number nine, as you already know. He said, when you become complacent, you relax. And when you relax, laziness sets in. Whatever it took you to get to the top must be maintained to stay at the top. The mistake we sometimes make is that we forget or we get so comfortable and complacent about our achievements that we stop doing what we did to get us to the top and in here let me insert something the late and the great dr miles monroe also said something he said that your greatest enemy is your last achievement your greatest enemy is your last success the success you enjoyed yesterday is your greatest enemy you it is okay to pad yourself a little bit at your back and say good job Vince 
you have done well. But don't let that stick to you. Don't let that get into your head and relax. Because the moment you get complacent, laziness will set in. And before you know it, you will come tumbling down. God bless you. And thanks for tuning in once again to Wisdom Pills. I salute you and I believe in your future. God bless you and go and keep working at it. Before you know it, you will be at the top. Bye-bye. You've been listening to Wisdom Pills with Dr. Vincent Opong, the voice of inspiration. See you on the next episode of Wisdom Pills. And please don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on becoming all you were born to be.